Hello and welcome to the Potential Difference Research Lab. My name is Thane Hines and I'm the President and CEO of Alnaut Ontario Clean Tech uh, Research and Development Company. Um, our company has developed uh, the RegenX generator and the RegenX quantum motor and uh, this video is being prepared for uh, Her Excellency, the Governor General of Canada. And uh, this video is an introduction to the RegenX quantum motor and the RegenX generator and the, a new law of physics called the Law of Creation of Energy. And uh, what I'm going to be doing in this demonstration is I'm going to be operating the Regen X generator and I'm going to be generating about uh, 90 watts of electricity uh, to our battery in the back. And uh, the Regen X generator differs from conventional electric generators in that it does not require any mechanical input power when it's generating electricity. In fact, the RegenX generator, when it's generating electricity, increases the kinetic energy of the system. So what the RegenX generator does is it harnesses subatomic electron energy that is uh, it's basically created at the subatomic level and the regen x generator harnesses subatomic electron electromagnetic field energy and it uses that energy uh, to increase the kinetic energy of the system and uh, also to generate electricity without any uh, mechanical input power. Uh, so I'm going to demonstrate the RegenX generator and then the RegenX quantum motor which is the world's first electric motor that harnesses Again, it harnesses created subatomic electron energy and it uses that energy to increase the kinetic energy of the system without requiring any externally supplied input energy. So every electric motor on the planet today requires uh, input energy in order to perform positive work in order to increase the kinetic energy of the system. The RegenX quantum motor on the other hand does not require any externally supplied input power to the motor when it's performing positive work and in increasing the kinetic energy of the system. So the the RegenX quantum motor harnesses subatomic harnesses created subatomic electron energy and it uses that energy to perform positive work and the RegenX quantum motor operates at infinite efficiency and the RegenX generator also harnesses subatomic uh, created electron energy to also perform positive work and to generate electricity without any mechanical input power. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start up the system and bring it up to speed and then I'll do a, a, a quick little demo of how the RegenX generator operates and then the RegenX quantum motor.
here is the the output that we're supplying from the generator to the battery. So currently our system is on uh, no load. It's at rotational equilibrium and we're going to deliver power to the battery, about 90 watts, and uh, we're not going to require any additional mechanical input power to the generator. So currently our generator is delivering about 90 watts to the battery. The generator is operating at infinite efficiency and is harnessing created subatomic electron energy in order to uh, increase the kinetic energy of the system by about uh, 70 joules. So we're back on no load again. And uh, with a conventional electric generator, if you want to deliver 90 watts of electric output power to a load, you must increase the input energy to the prime mover. And with the Regen X generator, no increase in uh, input power to the prime mover is required. As we can see, when the Regenix generator is placed on load, the input uh, requirement to the prime mover goes down instead of up. This means that the Regen X generator is operating at infinite efficiency. It's delivering electric output power, but it requires no mechanical input power to be uh, supplied to it from the prime mover. So we're at rotational equilibrium again, and I'm going to demonstrate the Regen X quantum motor, which is going to increase the kinetic energy of the system. By about 150 joules. And in order to increase the kinetic energy of the system by 150 joules, we need to supply uh, 150 joules of energy to the system. However, we are not supplying external energy to the system. We are harnessing the subatomic created electron electromagnetic field energy uh, as the new sustainable energy source to uh, allow the quantum motor to perform its work. quantum motor has increased the speed of the system. The Regen X quantum motor is performing positive work. It's operating at infinite efficiency, meaning that no externally supplied input energy is required. And the Regen X quantum motor is harnessing the subatomic uh, electron electromagnetic field energy. Once again, our system is at rotational equilibrium. The prime mover is 
Clark Energy principle, both state that in order to increase the kinetic energy of the system, the power that's being consumed by the prime mover must go up. And what you will see is that the, the input energy to the prime mover goes down. to the prime mover goes down by almost 200 watts. We're performing about 150 joules of uh, kinetic energy increase. We are harnessing 150 joules of created subatomic electron energy and our quantum motor is performing work without externally supplied energy. is the world's first electric motor that performs work without uh, externally supplied energy and the Regenex quantum motor operates at infinite efficiency when it's performing work and the Regenex generator which is the world's first electric generator that generates electricity but it also operates at infinite efficiency and harnesses the subatomic electron energy uh, in order to allow it to generate electricity at infinite efficiency. The, uh, the new law of physics that our company is introducing, the law of creation of energy and the subatomic electron energy uh, that we are uh, identifying with our technology is a new form of sustainable clean energy that uh, is constantly being created at the subatomic level. And uh, um, what we're hoping is that on November 5th uh, that uh, the Governor General will uh, grace us with her presence and allow us to demonstrate the technology, the new law of physics, the law of creation of energy, and the new source of uh, sustainable, clean uh, energy that allows all electricity to be generated uh, without mechanical input power and for electric motors to perform work without um, electric input power. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video. And cheers for now.